uh, with your life. At age 80, retired Chicago physician and educator Dan Winship is getting a bittersweet last chance to teach medicine. Only this time, he's the subject. I have uh, this disease. I have, what is it? Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's disease. Recently diagnosed with the devastating memory disease, Winship has joined a pioneer buddy program at Northwestern University that pairs medical students with Alzheimer's patients in the early stages. Similar programs are now underway at other medical schools. Winship and his buddy, first-year med student Jared Worthington, are building a friendship, dining together, visiting museums, chatting about Winship's medical career and Worthington's plans for his own. The program gives young doctors to be an unusual insight into an illness affecting an increasing number of people worldwide. He can teach me about you know, what it's like to have Alzheimer's, and so I can use that knowledge in the future to sort of inform how I do interact with patients and um, hopefully treat them with more compassion and understanding. But it also gives patients a chance to stay socially engaged before their illness eventually robs their minds. We talk together, we talk the same language. He is a very good student. He's learning and learning, learning, and that means everything to me. Organizers hope the program will encourage more medical students to pursue careers related to aging and dementia. It's a specialty few medical students pursue, but one for which the demand is rapidly increasing. More than 5 million Americans currently have Alzheimer's disease, a number expected to triple by 2050. Kelly Daschle, Associated Press.